What's Hi. Up? What is up, nerds? How we doing? Told you we'd be back. <laughs> Same clothes and everything. It's because yeah. we're lazy, useless bums. Or we're doing two videos in a row. Probably. That's probably it. Most likely. Say hi to George. Hi, George. Anyway, so we, well, uh, Richie, <laughs> I can't, I can't speak. Richie just finished his, uh, over morning. Damn it, sorting, And the cat is still rubbing up against the legs of the tripod <laughs> because he loves it just so much. <laughs> that we just don't apparently <laughs> jackass anyway be nice so our so, over morning funny story backtrack god damn it george <laughs> backtracking from that i basically have not been on pottermore in so long that i could not i, I had to go he's create never an been account to again. the new pottermore account which right. let me say it right now I hate the new Pottermore site. I mean, it looks nice and all, but I really hate not being able to access the old information whenever I want to go look something up. And I've never actually got to read the sixth and seventh book stuff. So, which me mad. Anyway, so back to what are you saying about it. About it yeah. So yeah, I basically had to create an account all over again. Not a big deal, it took like two seconds. But then I had to resort myself again, which I did. Which you got Gryffindor again, obviously. Which I got Gryffindor again. Yeah. He got Gryffindor, I got Ravenclaw again. And then I'm pretty positive. Hey look, like Hogwarts. Like 95% positive, I got exactly the same wand as I got last time too. I don't think I did. I got a 13 inch U wand with dragon heart string, dragon heart string, and uh, it is flexible, semi flexible. Yeah, mine wasn't. Mine's bitter, brittle, brittle. I don't know why I said bitter. I'm not tasting my wand, <laughs> but yes, I got brittle last time too. But that I I hate change, so that's probably why. However, I'm pretty sure my wood has changed. I, I did have unicorn hair last time. I did have a 10 inch. I did have a brittle wand, but hey, I Lexi. don't think I had redwood. Shut up right Mine, now. Mine's bigger. Shut up. I should hope yours is bigger. You're a guy, a biological male. I am biologically female. Mine better be smaller than yours, okay? What if you were half giant? Then your wand should be biological than mine. female human. Oh, okay. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Better get it your shit straight. Okay, God. So. What if your parents were like Andre the Giant, the freakishly tall woman from the circus? I'm the child of two muggles. Okay, there is no doubt about that. There is nothing magical about them. <sighs> but yeah. <laughs> Basically, her wand is made from a really lucky wood. Is it redwood? Yeah. Green that gives... fucking green. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen redwoods? <laughs> They're huge. Trees. <laughs> Dude, okay, so I was taking... I'm sorry, I have to go off. Of course you do. Yes, you you, you know why. Okay, so I we were taking why. Ari's three month photos, <laughs> and at one point she just does this, and <laughs> so I had to take a picture. I, I had to put the little comment underneath aliens. That's her three month photo. <laughs> That's the only one I put on Facebook. Yep. <laughs> yep. Does it make me a bad mom? No. Okay, good. It makes you awesome. Are you kidding me? Yay. So. <laughs> Because we didn't do month one and month two, and we probably no, I completely forgot about them. Probably ended up forgetting a whole bunch of those damn things. Well, I but have stickers in the kitchen now, so I can remember. Instead of under a pile of clothes, and stuff. yeah, well, whatever. What was your one? You, right? You, the same as Voldemort. Yeah. So, yeah. Her wand is basically lucky wood, no. consistent magic. Yes. It's not lucky. It's reputable. It's like its its reputation is. Being, you know, yeah. lucky. 
but it actually just gets with wizards. It just chooses the wizards and witches that happen to have good fortune. Right. That's why it has the reputation of it. Right. Um, it's also very, very, very um, loyal to its first master. Yeah. Yeah. With unicorn and, string, and unicorn which hair is very, work. very consistent on its magic. Not powerful, but I'm okay with that. I'm good with just consistent. Just don't stop on me. <laughs> It'll be fine. Don't stop believing. Okay. We've been watching Glee lately. <laughs> She's been watching Glee lately. He's been coming home to me watching Glee lately. And usually turning it off. But anyway, I managed to walk into the door just at the right time. For the Journey I, Medley. What, yeah. At the Ridge. And I was like. In season one. <laughs> I will watch this because it's Journey. And Journey's the shit. Yeah. Moving along. More fireworks. Yeah. Sorry. ADD keeps distracting me. Catch 22 with the. Um, Unicorn. unicorn string is that unicorn hair. Unicorn hair. Dragon heart string. Shut unicorn up, hair. woman. Phoenix. Betty. Yeah, I, I know. Problem with the unicorn hair is that she, uh, the unicorn <laughs> hair can basically die if it gets sad. Yeah, the unicorn hair can get sad. Like it has emotions. What the hell? And then they have to <laughs> replace the the hair. I'll, I'll be nice to my wand. I don't want to have to replace the hair. I don't want it to die on me. It's so sad. And then it's brittle because she hates change. I hate change. I really do. The length really doesn't matter because... No. Yeah. And so the fact that hers is 10 inches and mine is 13 inches really doesn't nothing. matter. Yeah. But mine is you wand. Or you would. Which is very powerful. Super powerful. Obviously, I mean, it shows Voldemort. Stupid powerful. Okay. Easiest. Oh, by the way, another thing okay. about her her redwood you want or redwood um, dragon hair uh, <laughs> unicorn hair <laughs> wand is it's like the hardest one to go again to go with uh, dark arts. Owner. No. No, I said that. Oh yeah. Dark but it'll hearts. go with a new owner, but it's dark, dark hearts. hearts. Yeah. But not ours. Yeah. Either a very big hero or a very big villain. Yeah. Or not the other. You won, which is stupid powerful. Cat. Damn cat. Stupid powerful. Stop it, George. <laughs> Hi, buddy. I also, it's one of the easiest that, that that'll actually go to the dark arts, which is why it's either you're either a fierce protector or a villain. So, Voldemort. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or me. Oh, you. Yeah. yeah. Walk in my house and I don't want you here. See what the fuck happens. With we a dra holly tree in the back. We can make Harry Potter's wand in the backyard. That's true. We just need a phoenix. We need fox. Fox. It's a phoenix named Fox. Fox. I know. Not box, box. I know. I know, Lexi. I was trolling. But <laughs> mine was a dragon heart string, which also is stupidly powerful. Like, so I'm just like, what the fuck are you doing with that cat? <laughs> He's gone. I'm done. I had an image of accepted whenever the dude's just sitting there waiting to get his picture taken for the fake ID. <laughs> it's actually kind of <laughs> I'm just like, ooh, I got a cat. I can actually do it. Meow. <laughs> Whatever. ADD. But tired. Dragon Heart Strength, which is also another retardedly powerful wand. Um, it, however, will go from, uh, it will, it, however, will have an affinity of going from master to master if its previous master was beaten while it's still like, while it still would prefer its first master. If it, if his first master gets beaten, it's more likely to accept the new master. Was the Elder one made from you? Or was just Voldemort's one made from you? I don't know, Lexi. Why don't you find that shit out? You've got a phone. I don't have a phone. We're doing a Harry Potter review. You may as well find that out, like, right now. Well, not for a review, but... Mm, yeah, whatever. 
but can't hear everywhere. And mine was fairly flexible. Anyway, because I'm fairly go with the flow. We've been talking about wands for ten minutes. I know. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> Ilver morning. Yeah. Ilver morning. I did mine, which ended up being. Okay, so there's one person on Tumblr. Oh yeah, backtrack. Um, call. Let's see. Their URL is the Consulting Drama Queen. They have like a really cool way of uh, figuring out the over morning sorting, because you know it's different from how the Hogwarts houses value, you know, the different traits. Um, and everyone was kind of confused and trying to figure out how they associated with each of the houses, which J.K. Rowling has said they do not affiliate with each of the houses. Um, and this person, they figured out that Horn Serpent is basically, I'm defined by what I think, so scholars and mind. Wampus is, I'm defined by what I do, so warrior's body. Um, Thunderbird, I'm defined by my experiences, adventurer, soul. And then Puckwudgie, I'm defined by what I feel, or maybe love. So, healers and heart. And I saw that, I'm like, oh my god, that makes sense. So, yeah. The Hogwarts houses is basically what you think is important, and then the Ilvermorny houses are basically, I define myself by... So. By blah. Blah. So that's, the, that's, that's, it makes sense to me, and so I'm like, I like that, that, that makes sense. So yeah, mine mine is horned serpent, which makes sense. Um, that one to me seems to most have to do with a Hogwarts house, because it's you know usually scholars and their it represents the mind or whatever, and that's most similar to Ravenclaw. So I can see the correlation there, but there are people that are in Ravenclaw that aren't in horned serpent. Same. But the other way around, there's people that are in Horn Serpent that aren't in Ravenclaw because, yeah, they're not the exact same. Yeah. They're just similar. Richie. Yeah. I got Puckwudgie. Puckwudgie. Which I actually guessed. She, I, she, I figured he'd be either Puckwudgie or Wampus. Yeah. I was either going to be this body warrior type dude or I was going to be this uh, more heart emotional type guy. Which. But the thing is, while he likes to think himself it's very warrior-ish. He's very emotional. Oh yeah, I can be. <laughs> so that's why I'm like, I think he's gonna be Puck Wedgie. Cause it's, oh, yeah. he, he definitely goes by he, how he feels about things. And yeah. whether he loves them and or he really hates them. Yeah. The thing with Puck Wedgie that made me laugh is like, <laughs> heart, healer. I was like, no, not healer. Definitely protector though. Yes. Definitely mm, protective. Not, not there's, healer. There's I one, wouldn't be a healer. One question that we both definitely answered the same. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, what was the question? I don't remember the question was. It was something pertaining to if you could do one of the following oh, yeah, things, which one would you do? And it was like... Um, go back in time and change something. Bring someone back from the dead. Um... Protect one person from harm, from harm and, and then, then go, one to the, other. go to the future. Yeah, and that. Then, no, no, no. It changed day in the future. There was like eight of them. Yeah, there's And some. then there was like, remove, uh, know the answer to one question that nobody knows the answer to, basically. And then there was another one that was like, uh, um, cure one disease from the earth and all that stuff. Doctor, cut. Yeah. We chose the same one for obvious reasons. One person from harm. Yep, definitely <laughs> protect that one person there. from harm. Though he I sat had there problems to for say. like five minutes looking at that one question. Because back in the gap when I was 16, my dad died in a drunk driving accident. And I was pissed off at the world and it was bullshit. That was almost 10 years ago. I know. So weird to think. I know. But, so I basically sat there and looked at that and went, change one day from the past, bring one person back from the dead, or keep someone from harm. And I was just sitting there like, oh, you bitch. You actually made this really difficult. Which in the end, 
I ended up doing the right thing. Which was making sure, that, you know, thinking about it and being like, okay, I would definitely have to make sure that my daughter was okay. Yeah. But that one was a pain in the ass. Like, I hated that question. So there was one annoying question. I think it was for the wand one, though. Oh, it was just the wand one? No, 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 not that one. The, the annoying question. What color are your eyes? Oh, yeah, yeah. Are black. they dark brown? Like are they, black, are they brown or are they, brown? Or are they dark brown or black? And I'm just like, uh, mine's like in the middle, and his, his is kind of in the middle. So it's like, uh, it's, it's, but brown, dark brown. Yeah. My dad's is almost black, so. Yeah. I think we got his eyes. But yeah, so I, I would totally not does. be a healer. My mama's got pretty eyes. I'm totally not a healer, but I am very emotional. I will burn that bridge down faster than you can throw than you can get the gasoline for it. Cat, what are you doing? Being stupid, Lexi. It's balancing on my sketchbook, and it's like balanced on two books, so the sketchbook's doing like this. It's like in a hammock of books. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, that was that's that's our bottom where yeah, I did it. I did it all over again just so that I can get into that damn house. But then uh, to to figure out what my over morning house would be. But I just kind of decided at the uh, at the beginning before I would do that house that I would just go back and see if I got the same old stuff. Which show enough. You're Gryffindor. There's no doubt about it. Remember, what was it? Ninety three percent. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> took that percentile test of what percentage of each house yeah. you are. It's like 93% Gryffindor. It wasn't even a question. Excuse I wrecked me. that shit. Anyway, so this video turned out to be much longer than I thought it would be. You talk a lot. Your face talks a lot. Not as much as yours. Uh, you suck. <sighs> okay, anyway, so... We're about ready for bed. It's it's getting late for us because we're now old people because we got a baby, which means we wake up a lot. It is 10.15. Yeah. See? We're old people now. Yeah. Speak for yourself. That's because you don't have to wake up a million times because you don't have to feed her from your chest. <laughs> Tis unfortunate. Yeah. Anyway. So, love you guys. That's okay. I'm just as much of an old person too. Mm. Bye. Later, nerds. You know where the button is? Yes.